My family moved from San Diego to Salt Lake when I was about 11 years old. And behind our house, there was this really big field where you know, no one ever was, and I always imagined myself flying something there. I was able to fly all the products on the market, and I really got frustrated with what was out there and, and what I wasn't able to do yet. And so I wanted one drone that could essentially do everything and, and that didn't restrict me to only doing one thing. And so with Teal, we wanted to open it up to many different use cases so it's not restricted to just one. I started the company about two years ago now. That's when we started product development. I raised our first pre-seed round of funding. Raising money was pretty hard, especially when you know I was just starting out. I didn't have a product, I didn't have a prototype. My dad was driving me around, I didn't have my driver's license, I had braces. About a year after that, we had some prototypes in hand that were working fantastic, and, and you know we realized that we had something. It's really like the Swiss Army knife of drones. It's fully modular on the hardware side, so it's upgradable as time goes on. It has a supercomputer built in, which gives it capabilities that no other drone has today, like machine learning, artificial intelligence, image recognition, autonomous flight. And it can also be used for developers. We offer SDKs and APIs to start building an app store around this product of many different use cases, like play games, race around. We can toss it up in the air, have it follow you around based on image recognition. And it's also the world's fastest production drone out of the box. It can fly over 70 miles an hour. It can fly in 40 mile an hour winds, in rain, snow, hail, you name it. The teal is one of the fastest birds in the world. Uh, it's an accessible bird. It's not like a hawk or a falcon, it's, it's a duck. <laughs>